Just as Africa is making its presence felt in the world of fashion, so is it poised to reinvent interior design. The recent Decorex Durban event showcased a selection of fresh decor ideas from our continent, including the intriguingly named She Sheds. Devon Sea and Sky flaunted a blue palette, but Tevin's attention was focused on interiors. If you're in search of KwaZulu Natal's premier decor design and lifestyle expo, then look no further because Decorex Durban has arrived once again. This year's theme being the rhythm of life, so join me for the art trends of 2018's feature installations and artful curations. Decorex has established a reputation for presenting new and fresh ideas with each event. And portfolio director Sine Cullingworth was looking forward to showing Tevin that this year's Durban edition was no exception. Sian, welcome to Mela. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. Thanks for having me. What is Decorex? Decorex Durban is the premier decor design and lifestyle exhibition within the region. And it really has everything under one roof. Every year we reinvent and our features are absolutely beautiful this year. We've got the Trend House, which is incredible with all the latest 2018 trends being showcased. And then of course we've got one of my favorite features, which is the She Shed. What is a She Shed to you? A She Shed is somewhere very special in a woman's home where they can go and it's a sanctuary for them. Now it's all about the She Sheds, celebrating women and what our needs are in the home. One of the four bespoke interiors was created especially for TV and stage personality Jaloshni Naidu, who unlike her auntie Rumba, has a clear preference for neutrals and earth tones, structured with clean, uncluttered lines. This year there's a particular focus on choosing four public figures and making them brand ambassadors uh, and getting uh, specific designers to design a shed. So just like you get a man cave <laughs> and all the things that men love in their man caves, they decided to focus on females and make a she shed. So they asked each of us, what kind of design would we expect if we had a she shed? Because it's kind of your haven, your go-to place. So what kind of lines, what kind of color? Just getting an idea of what our personalities were and who we really are. Now what is a she shed to you? For us a she shed means a space for a woman to escape to, whether it be to create, to design, to daydream, just a tranquil space for her to be in a calming, nurturing environment. Each shed interior reflected the celebrity's tastes and personality and in this case the designer created something cohesive from a variety of very different elements. You guys were paired up with different celebrities. So who is your celeb and what did she ask for? Our celebrity is Mary Ambassa. She wanted something a bit more on the calm side, so having some under earthy tones to it, but she loves color too. And obviously we wanted to incorporate some pink for the pink drive. Mariam co-starred with Jay Lostein, keeping up with the Gandasamis, but a granny Aya character is a far cry from the actor's real personality. I have to tell you, they got it exactly the way I want. The comfort, the look, I could sit in there forever. Kajal Bhagwandin is inspired by luxury, comfort and nature. But she also has a strong connection with the breast cancer awareness aspect of the project. What is a she shed to you? A she shed is a female version of a man cave. So everything that you think of for guys, it's for women. Look, when I first heard of it, I thought it was quite a strange name. It's also difficult to say She Shed. But I think it's a wonderful idea, and I think why not have one for women as well? And the She Shed has been directly linked to the Pink Drive. They link naturally because it is for women, about women. And I think it's something we should all support. And why I want to support the Pink Drive specifically, I've had people in my life that have been affected by breast cancer. And if a test can save someone's life, then that's enough reason to do it. Michelle, what inspired the design today? We utilised some of the latest colours and incorporated it into the backdrop. Also created beautiful butterflies that are made from leaves and painted beautiful patterns of various shades of pink and purple. Michelle created something that is more of an art installation, paying homage to breast cancer survivors and fighters. And this sculpture particularly, it's paying homage to somebody who has had breast cancer before. This tree woman is a generic, really. She isn't black, she isn't white, she isn't colored, she isn't Indian. She's just there as a symbol to women. It's almost like a phoenix, you know, to me, coming out of the fire. And that's what we want people to be, fighters and survivors. Radio personality, Vukil M. Kenzie has to pack 25 hours into a typical working day. 
so her space had to fulfill a dual purpose, enabling her to be creative or at rest, depending on her needs at the time. I wanted a space where I could work, but a space that didn't feel like an office, that didn't feel like a study, but I could work and I could relax. Bukile's shed was created by designer Jennifer Jones. Jennifer, what is a she shed to you? We as women today are really multidimensional. We are mothers, we are businesswomen, we are cooks in the kitchen, and it's that that I also wanted to translate. As part of Africa Day and the African theme, what are your thoughts on South Africa's position in terms of design? Just the show here this year is an absolutely wonderful example of the talent that we've got in this country, the production and the product that's available to everybody. With styles ranging from trendy to timeless, there was an idea for every interior. Well, there you have it from deco and design to she sheds and pink drives. This has been the 17th installation of Decorex Durban and it's been an incredible journey. What a wonderful time to be African.